Well, 21 states are suing the CDC over the federal government's mandatory mask policy when riding public transportation. Virginia is included in that suit. 10 on your side's Michelle Wolf joins us tonight with a breakdown of the filing. Michelle. Yeah, so the 30 page document calls out the federal mask mandate on public transit, calling it arbitrary and capricious. The measure is set to expire April 18th, but some states want, it, want to see it end sooner. 21 states are calling on the federal government to end mandatory masking on aircrafts, trains, vehicles, and ships, stating the mandate violates the Constitution and the Administrative Procedure Act. The states, including Virginia, claim they were negatively affected by the policy by expending resources to enforce the mandate, and that many states have policies in place that discourage mask requirements in contexts where the mask mandate applies. The lawsuit echoes concerns from U.S. airlines earlier this month that pushed to remove the mask mandate after passengers became combative with airline staff. The mask mandate is one of the few restrictions still in place two years into COVID-19. 16 states, including North Carolina, are still in an active state of emergency. North Carolina Governor Roy Cooper addressed the state's status in a news conference earlier this month. It gives flexibility to health care providers to help with surges that come, and it helps uh, health care providers distribute vaccines and treatment to people. It's a legal tool that we are using to provide the flexibility that's needed. And when the legislature passes a law to give that flexibility that's needed, then we'll do away with it. Now, the CDC has not commented on the litigation. The lawsuit also calls for the CDC to pay legal fees. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.